The start of this week is going to be a lot warmer than the, the end to the week. And uh, that's good news. Just looking ahead at the end of the week, too, by the way, it could be the coldest day that we've had so far this oh, season. Wow. Maybe the coldest day since March of last year. That's how long oh, it's boy. been. But uh, let's let's focus on near term. I said mild. You know, it's going to be warmer here to start the week. Not bad. Now, today it's dry. We're certainly drier than we were yesterday, but some areas with a little fog this morning. There may also be some drizzle in a few spots, but temperatures are above freezing. So that's the, the headline this morning. We're above freezing, so the roads are wet, but at least it's above freezing. This afternoon, temperatures climb into the mid 30s. We'll, we'll really stay around the mid 30s uh, pretty much all day. A lot of clouds, especially through the morning. Could see some breaks in the clouds by this afternoon, so we might see the sun peeking its way out after about 2 o'clock or so later today. Right now, most of the rain and the steady precipitation is south and east of us. This storm system is pulling away, but there's still some low level moisture and winds are pretty light, but they're going to be out of the northeast today, and so that could keep in some low level moisture, low level clouds around southeast Michigan and Metro Detroit. There could be fewer clouds as you head farther to the west some peaks of sun turning most of the sunny. In fact, around the Lansing and Flint by this afternoon. Um, but some low clouds hanging around Metro Detroit most of the day today. Some patchy fog, but visibility isn't too big of an issue right now. Two and a half miles in Detroit. That's the lowest visibility I see, so it shouldn't be a big problem. And it's 34 in Ann Arbor, 35 right now in Detroit, and temperatures are going to tap out about 37 this afternoon. So mid-30s, above freezing pretty much all day. A lot of clouds through the morning. Some breaks in the clouds by this afternoon. Tonight lows around 26 degrees. Partly cloudy skies will be mostly cloudy tomorrow. Uh, another dry day tomorrow. And most of Wednesday looks dry, too. I'm going to move quickly through the future cast so I can get to Wednesday. This is 8 p.m. Tuesday night. A cold front is to our northwest. This starts to dive to the south by Wednesday afternoon. And then moisture is pulling in from the north. And bottom line, this will mean snow accumulating Wednesday night through the day Thursday. Colder air then follows, and that pushes in Friday. And that's why Friday could be the coldest day since the beginning of March of last year. This could be the first day this season that we have high temperatures below 25 degrees. Looking at 22 Friday. By the way, Thursday snow should be light, but around three inches of snow is possible throughout the day. And then colder on Friday. Emory.